Dozens of people with disabilities staged a protest today over the closure of their day centre. Demonstrators fear that they'll be left with nowhere to go. Helen Astle reports. Campaigners from Douglas Bader Day Centre arrived at Leicester Town Hall this morning to protest about it closing. The centre means a lot of things to a lot of people. Um, to lots of people, it's, it's their second home. People have been there over 40 years. The centre provides help for over 100 people with disabilities. It recently closed because a report deemed it a fire risk. Supporters are worried the council will use it as an excuse to permanently shut the centre. People are getting really down, getting really depressed. Um, it's, it's not knowing that's the, the biggest problem. If people would communicate with us a lot better and tell us exactly what's going on, it, it would be a lot better. I couldn't speak. I couldn't uh, use my hands. Uh, now I can do everything. I was uh, very, very depressed and I didn't know where to go. And but then I joined the Douglas Bader Centre and it helped me. In a statement, the City Council say their first priority is safety. A meeting is due to take place tomorrow between the campaigners and the council. Helen Astle, East Midlands Today, Leicester.